new technique for minimally invasive crestal sinus lift with magnetic mallet. The preoperative CBCT shows a pneumatization of the right maxillary sinus. The residual vertical bone in the molar area is variable from 6 to 8 mm. The full thickness flap surgical approach with scalpel blade 15C. Perfection of the incision and lifting of the flap with Mitchell scaler before and preacher periosteal elevator after. Initial osteotomy of implant size with piezoelectric diamond tool. Deepening of osteotomy with piezoelectric diamond tools. Vertical and horizontal handle preparation of the side of about 2 mm. The magnetic mallet is a completely innovative device for oral and implant surgeries. The surgical procedures in which the traditional manual mallet was used can take advantage of the use of this innovative magnetodynamic device, complex extractions, maxillary sinus elevation, vertical and horizontal compaction, bone expansion. Compared to the manual mallet, the magnetic mallet has a better control of the force transmitted to the bone, improving the surgical procedures and reducing of the risk of BPPV. The magnetic mallet delivers a high intensity electromagnetic impact applied in a very short time. Plastic deformation of the bone is achieved in a safe and controlled way. The four speeds offer the surgeon the choice of force control based on the type of surgery and the density of the receiving bone with greater safety margin, greater precision and greater reproducibility of the protocols. Once the Snyder's membranes has been elevated, simple scaffolds like a fibrin sponge can be introduced to maintain the space obtained. Apply the fibrin sponge twice per size. The hand pins of the magnetic mallet is used with one hand and the pulses are controlled with a foot switch, leaving the other hand free and allowing greater visibility of the operating field. Washing with rifamicin antibiotic before inserting the fixtures. CSR by Sweden and Martina. Conometric connection implants. Motor insertion with torque control in prepared bone size without rotating drills. Motorized bone level position of fixtures at 40 newton per centimeter. Final check with torque branch at 50 newton per centimeter. Surgical positioning of the healing abutments at 10 newton per centimeter. Closure of the surgical flaps with the Sweden and Martina Monosoft Surgical Suture. Non absorbable PTFE 40 monofilament.
the X-rays show the preoperative situation and that of the day of the surgery. Soft tissue healing after one month and partial mineralization of the grafted areas. After three months, the almost complete mineralization of the grafted areas and the intraoral scan with the cover strip for the prosthesis of the two elements. Processing of the scanner file in the laboratory and CAD CAM design of the skew retained temporary restorations. Greetings from Stefano Lombardo, Turin, Italy.